In this video, we're going to focus on the Zoom In button in the Chart.js plugin for Zoom. So basically what we did so far is we have created a reset button here. Every time we click on this, we will reset it. If we zoom in here, we will reset it. There you are. So this is quite useful, but you might want to have as well control on the Zoom In and the Zoom Out button. So let's start and work on how to do a Zoom In button first. To do this, we must understand one of the options here. And if we go back here to the options and we search here for the zoom and then we search here on the wheel, you'll see the speed here. Basically, this is quite useful to understand. So basically what happens is we need to increase it by a decimal, basically, just to zoom in. So how are we going to do it? Well, basically in here, we're going to create a new button. We can almost copy this here, but we'll just put it in here. Let's say here, button on click equal and here we say zoom we can do a zoom button and the reason why is that we can use this for multiple functions and then in here we can say now in this case we could just put for specific here we will have this there is zoom in here zoom in So once we have this, we scroll down here, and then we may create a new function here below. And this function will be called the zoom button. If I'm not mistaken, it's capital letter, so it's not. Oh, let's make that here. Copy this. Put it in here. The zoom button. And then here, what we can say is my chart dot zoom. And then here we put in the value of the zoom. This would be, for example. 1.1 indicating an increase of 10 percent so if we save this now and refresh you will see here now we have a zoom button and now we're able to zoom in as you can see we're zooming in pay attention here the purple goes away because we have this this specific arrangement of colors the after purple will be red so you will see that this will be zoomed in and this part here starts to zoom in as well so this one is being removed and if we move here we can pan out if you're panning I have still the drag effect on it as well, the, the zoom drag. But if I would disactivate that, let me just deactivate that one. Put it in here. All right, save that, refresh. And here now, if we zoom in, and now I move, there you are. You're able to move and pan left and right. And if we reset again, there we are. If we can do this, and same here, what we can do as well as we want to then zoom in more, even more, what we can do is increase the amount here. Let's say we want to zoom in 50%. So we can refresh here. And then we click on zoom. And then you can see instantly we're zooming in far more values, as you can see. And then here we click on this again, again, again. There you are. And this is basically how you can use the zoom. And it's basically here similar to what we did here with the options. Where we are focused on the speed. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoy it. And if you enjoy this video, you probably will enjoy this one as well. And if you're interested in Chart.js, check out in the description box the link directing to my Chart.js course where you can learn everything about Chart.js. And finally, of course, make sure you subscribe to my channel.